Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So as you guys can see from the bags behind me, I am finally doing my Bath & Body Works SAS haul. Oh my God, I get so excited about the SAS every time it comes around. And I always be like, oh, I'm not gonna go back. I'm only gonna go like once or twice. And then I end up going in there every day just to see what they put out if anything new comes out. Um, this time around this year, I really was looking for like since that i've never tried before that might have came out like four or five years ago because i do feel like sometimes they will bring back scents from like you know a while ago that people have been asking for or wanting to see return and so that's mainly what i went to go and look for because i still have a lot of my body care from the semi-annual sale last year and the year before that and the year before that so i didn't really need any of those type of body care items and things like that that I just really wanted to get things that I haven't tried before but I still ended up with some of my favorites some way somehow but um, I'm happy with everything that I got and if I do go back then it will just be to get since that I have not tried before I do not want to have duplicates of the same thing so let's get right into what I got okay so starting with this first bag I did go ahead and pick up a set of dark kiss because at the last in my annual sale I don't know why but I heard a lot of people talking about this fragrance and I was just like why have I never you know tried this fragrance out and I just really wanted to try it for myself so I smelled it in store and it's definitely something that I could see myself wearing i know a lot of people say that this is like a fall nighttime scent but in all honesty i can see myself wearing this during the summer um this is black raspberry burgundy rose bergamot incense dark vanilla bean and plum musk and to me i get all of those i get all of those berry notes first and then i get some bergamot and then maybe like a slight creaminess at the end so um this is definitely a scent that i like so i had to pick up the entire set of that next i had to re-up on one of my favorite scents this is the peach and honey almond fine fragrance mist every single time i wear this scent i get compliments on it it is one of my favorite scents of all time it just i think it works with my body chemistry so well it just smells so good i love that it has like that fresh peachiness to it and then it has like a nutty almond scent and then there's a tangerine scent as well there's some floral i just really really like this scent it's like an all-around good one i feel like this is the most complex scent that bath and body works actually has like when they put the notes together on this one they did such a good job it is to me it is so different than anything else that they have so I definitely had to go and pick up another one of these. And then from that same line, I also got a lemon, lemon pomegranate cream fine fragrance mist. Um, I had the lotion to this last year. So I just wanted to go ahead and pick up the fine fragrance mist of this because I really do like this scent. I like that tartness that it has it just smells really really good and then i went ahead and picked up a amber blush shower gel i have the amber blush fine fragrance mist so i wanted to just go ahead and add something else to my collection um this says this ultra feminine scent is a sensual blend of raspberry champagne gardenia petals and magnolia blossom with the seductive kiss of crystallized amber and creamy vanilla suede so a lot of notes in this one but y'all know i am a fan of any of the champagne bubbly type of scents they just they get me every time and this one definitely smells very effervescent like i don't know it just has a really light bubbly note and then it has some fruit as well. It's just a really, really good one. I feel like this is a very feminine, perfumey type of scent. So I definitely wanted to get something to go with my fine fragrance mist. I got a Boardwalk Marshmallow Clouds Ultra Shea Body Cream. I have two of the fine fragrance mist back there on my shelf. I really enjoy this scent. I remember when I first smelled it, I did not like it because everyone was comparing this to Beach Nights. And I was like, this is definitely not Beach Nights whatsoever. Beach Nights is so different. Definitely has more of a like um, salty note to it. And this one is just more light and fluffy, airy. Smells like vanilla. 
you know but this is actually a really really good scent the more that i smelled it the more that i liked it and i also get compliments on this one a lot when i wear it so i just wanted to go ahead and pick up a body cream to go with my fine fragrance mist and i actually do not like using the body creams during the summertime because i just feel like they're a little bit too heavy for me i don't have dry skin i have pretty normal skin so the lotions do me just fine so i probably will not be using this uh this summer it's just a personal preference for me and then the last thing from this bag this is the black sand body scrub so i wanted to get another body scrub because the one that i have right now is running out and i don't think i have any more body scrubs so i got this one this is the um bali black sand and i actually do have the shower gel lotion and fine fragrance mist for this scent so i just went ahead and picked this up it smells really good and i don't know if you guys are going to be able to see but the actual um scrub has like little shimmers in it i really like that so i think that this would be really nice for the summertime i don't know if you guys can see the actual shimmers inside of the scrub it's really pretty so i can't wait to use this so this next bag is going to be my pocket bags and my wallflowers i needed to restock on wallflowers because the only ones I have now are like fall scents and I just was not going to use those in my house. I definitely want my house to smell really fruity and fresh right now. So I had to go ahead and read up on those. So um, let me just pull them all out of the bag. Wallflowers were kind of just all over the place. So I picked up a eucalyptus mint by mistake. I did want to return this one, but I think I am going to give it a try because I've never actually tried eucalyptus mint. I'm going to put it in the bathroom downstairs no one really uses that one so i'm gonna put it downstairs and see how i like it um and then i got two of the lemon mint leaf this is one of my absolute favorite fragrances i love this in both the wallflower and the candle this is zesty lemon verbena and fresh spearmint leaves this is just so fresh to put in the bathroom it's one of my favorite fragrances for the bathroom and then i got two of the pink apple punch wallflowers because this smells so good i remember i think i had this scent in a candle like sometime last year and i did not like it at all i was like there's something off about this candle it smells really like artificial and plasticky so i returned it and got something different but this year they must have changed the notes and and did it better because it smells so good to me now this is green apple juicy honey crisp and pink melon punch so i got two of those and then i got two pear berries because this is such a classic scent that i really really like it's wild anjou pears juicy berries and sheer musk i had the body care set of this last year and i just really like pear berry and then i got a coconut lime breeze which is zesty lime lemon verbena and sheer coconut i just really like these type of citrusy scents for the bathroom i feel like they just make your bathroom feel so fresh and clean um and then i got five of the pocket backs and i also got a pocket back holder so this is the pocket back holder that i got and i just needed something new to go on my key ring because i'm tired of the one that i have on there now so i just went ahead and got that and then i got a raspberry lemon sorbet hand sanitizer this packaging is so cute i got an orange ice pop also really cute boardwalk vanilla cone this one is my favorite. Ugh, I love Boardwalk Vanilla Cone. We have a Boardwalk Vanilla Cone hand soap downstairs in the kitchen. I love it so much. This one is Birthday Wishes in Cake Batter. And then the last one I got is Berry Galactic Swirl. So I just love my pocket bags. I use them all the time and I'll always buy them. They don't ever have a sale on pocket bags. Pocket bags are always five for six dollars, but I feel like that's a good deal. I use them all the time. So I just go ahead and get them whenever I can. So this next bag is going to be my candles. And I actually have more candles coming in because I bought these candles on the first day and they were $12.95. And then this weekend, they turned around and had like a $10.50 candle sale. So I ordered four more candles um, during that sale. So I do have more candles coming in. I did not want to go crazy with the candles just because I have not been burning candles a lot like how I used to. I used to go through candles like it was nothing, but now I just haven't been burning them. So I didn't want to go crazy with buying them. Um, so I got a pink apple punch because like I said, this fragrance, they really did it better this year. So I got one of those. I got a saltwater 
taffy which this packaging is so cute and this smells so good it's chewy vanilla cream fresh berries and juicy cherry and this honestly smells like um crunch berries captain crunch crunch berries that is exactly what this smells like so i wanted to get that because it just smells really really good and then i got a summer boardwalk which is so good i have one of these back there somewhere i think but um caramel glazed popcorn warm taffy apples and salty sweet cream you can definitely smell the apple and caramel in this and popcorn this is another one of those scents sort of like the peach and honey almond i feel like it's a very complex scent like the way that they captured all of the fragrance notes in this they did such a good job with this so i really really like this candle and then i got a salted pretzel milkshake which this is so cute i love this packaging i wish the wax would have been the same color as the wording on here it is so pretty but this smells so good this is creamy vanilla ice cream salty pretzel bits and gooey chocolate drizzle i feel like you definitely smell the chocolate and the pretzel in this so good um i don't really get the creamy vanilla ice cream i think that's because ice cream is such a hard note to capture but it definitely smells like um chocolate and pretzels and then i got a london tea and lemon i love this wraparound packaging of london this is so cute i'm actually going to keep this one when i'm done burning it but tea and lemon is another one of my favorites it just smells so good it says perfect afternoon tea sparkling sugar and lemon zest this is another scent that's very effervescent and bubbly and it smells very light and airy so good definitely smells like lemon definitely smells like tea i really like this and then i did go ahead and get one of their single wicks seven ounce candles i actually bought two of these but i gave one to a friend so this is seattle and this is white caramel cold brew and I love my coffee and this smells like coffee so I just went ahead and picked this one up they were on sale for I think six dollars so I just went ahead and got it um and then I got some hand soaps so I got a fresh lemonade this is a standard in my household I love fresh lemonade and I got it in the deep cleansing because this is going in the kitchen and then I got an island margarita another one that's really really good that's gonna do good in like the bathroom or the kitchen got a watermelon lemonade another one that absolutely have to have every year cucumber melon staple can't go wrong with that one key lime biscotti which is actually a new one this is zesty key lime creamy vanilla filling and then fresh biscotti so to me oh, this one smells so good so this one definitely has a citrusy scent but then it has sort of like a cookie type of scent to it as well it's, it's very nice um this one is definitely probably going to go in one of the bathrooms it smells really really good and then i got another boardwalk vanilla cone because i love boardwalk vanilla cone okay so the last bag is just a mix up of everything in it i got body care i got soaps i got hand creams i got wallflowers it's just a mix up of everything so i did get two of these super rich moisturizing body washes and this is in warm vanilla sugar and i just kind of got these to go along with lotions and sprays that don't really have a body wash match to them so that's what i got these for and these typically last me a really really long time so i'm just going to use these in conjunction with other things that don't have a match i got a lavender marshmallow gentle foaming hand soap because i really like this scent i remember i didn't used to like this scent because i wasn't a big fan of lavender but my scent preferences have changed because now i like lavender scents and this is actually a really really good scent i had it in like a little mini wick candle actually i had a three wick and i had a little mini wick candle of that scent and i really do like it now and then i got pink petal tea cake i remember everyone went so crazy over this scent when they brought it back in candle form it's pink rose petals pound cake and vanilla glaze and i'm not gonna lie i do really really like this scent when it first came out in the candle i just could not see why everyone was going crazy over it i was like it's so floral but now because i like florals i get the hype i really get it so um yeah then i got a georgia peach and sweet tea i've seen people rave about this scent and i just could not for the life of me understand why and now i get it i so get it this smells 
so 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 good i feel like this is gonna be another one that i'm gonna wear and i'm gonna get so many compliments on it i just i can feel it it smells so good and then I got a Sunset Guava Colada Ultra Shea Body Cream. I can't remember if I have anything else in this um, fragrance, but I just went ahead and got it because it was in the 75% off bin and I was just like, let me just grab it. Um, so then I got three hand creams because I really do like and use their hand creams and they were on sale three for seven I believe so I got a Waikiki Beach Coconut which is one of my favorite summer scents. I got Almond which is definitely one of my favorite scents. I don't know um, if I ever told you guys but I had an Almond Wallflower in my baby's room when he was first born and so now I associate this scent with him and so whenever I see anything in the scent Almond I just grab it because I know I'm gonna love it. And then I got a plain strawberry hand cream which smells amazing. And the last thing in this bag is all of my wallflowers. I told you I needed to restock on my wallflowers because I only had fall scents. So I got two almond wallflowers. Already know I'm going to love those. I got a sun ripened raspberry, which they had this in the body care, but I actually didn't like the body care. It's sweet berries, sheer sunlight, and sugar crystals. You would think I would like it because it's just berries and sugar, but for some reason I did not like the body care. Um, I got a cucumber melon because it's a classic. Oh, I got another almond. I didn't know I got three almonds. Um, I got another lemon mint leaf. And then I got a coconut water, which this is one that's going to go in the bathroom as well. Coconut milk, creamy vanilla, and pineapple. And then I got a cranberry peach prosecco, which I think this one is new. Matter of fact, I got two of these, but I think the tag came off of this one. But um, this is new to me. It says sweet peaches, tart cranberry, and gala apple. I feel like I'm really going to like this one. So I went ahead and got two of them when I saw them. I feel like that was a lot of talking, but that is everything that I got from the sale. Like I said, I don't really think that I need to get anything else except for um, body care that's like really really hard to find or that they brought back from a few years ago that's the only reason why i need to go back because i feel like i'm pretty set on everything else wallflowers hand soaps i think i'm really good on that so um yeah if you guys like this video then give it a big thumbs up and leave me a comment down below if you're new you should definitely hit that subscribe button as well as the bell notification so that you are notified every single time that i upload a video and i will see you guys in my next one peace